Hello, people of the internet. Um, today we're going to talk about competition. Um, how many times have you been working on a project with your coworkers? Um, only for both of you guys to be working in parallel paths. So, so you're working on one thing. He's working on the same thing that you guys are. You're both working on exactly the same path um, for the same project or same asset or whatever that you guys are supposed to be working on. Um, and you look over his stuff and you're like, man, he's doing this stuff really great or whatever. And it starts putting pressure on you. And so you start trying to like push outside of the world that you would normally go down, like the path that you would normally go down. You start veering from what you would normally do as design because you're seeing what your coworker is doing. So you feel like, well, I need to do something that's better than that. So then you start doing something you not normally do. So you're competing with him. How many times have you felt like you're in a competition with a coworker? When you guys are a part of the same team, a part of the same stuff, you feel like you're you're competing with him. Like that if his design's chosen that you lost, and then for some reason internally, even if you're not gonna get let go because of it or whatever, that it's like, oh no, whoever has the best design is gonna keep their job. Even if it's not like that, how many times have you felt like it's like that? Like if your coworker's design got chose over your design, that you are somehow lesser of a person or like a, a not as good of a designer at that time or whatever that you're you're just not up to snuff like you're not you're not good enough um how many times have you struggled with that because i know that i struggle with that pretty much my entire career every single time that i've ever had to work with somebody else with a coworker or something like that and say the cd or whatever wants us both to go down the same path because that gives us variety in our in our choices. Sometimes we do that when we're building boards and stuff like that to give us several different scenarios for what this stuff could look like. And then I happen to look over to the screen next to mine or in front of me or whatever, and I and I see something that my coworker is doing, and I'm like, "Whoa, that is really good." And then in my mind, for some reason, I'm like oh no, mine is total crap and I need to step up my game like 10 times that and I'll stay late and I'll work harder to whatever to try to achieve a goal that wasn't actually even the goal that I was supposed to be doing at the first place, right? Like I'm not supposed to be building something that's better than him. I'm supposed to be going parallel, you know, parallel paths to, to find as many options as we can with the same project. Um, I struggle with that all the time. And I've found lately that, that that's, that's something that's actually affected my own mind, right? Because I'm, I just, when, when somebody else's design gets chosen over mine, I find that it, there, there's that point in me where I feel like, oh, I'm just not as good. I'm not, you know, I just, I, I suck at designing. I'm terrible at this thing. And it goes into this weird, like depressing world, you know, where like I could have knocked it out of the park. Like the project right before, the asset thing that I built right before that was amazing and it got all this praise or whatever. And then literally the next project, it's like, oh, I'm the worst designer ever. And that's only because a coworker who's working on the same project as me got a design that got chosen over mine. And, and that's not how that should be. You guys should be able to be able to work with each other. Even if you're working on the same stuff, you guys should be able to work with each other, encourage each other, lift each other up and be like, man, that design was amazing. Can you show me something from that? Can you show me how you did these things or what you thought about when you were starting to come up with these concepts? Because truth is, he's probably thinking the same thing you were thinking when he was looking at your stuff. And that even though you're thinking, oh man, this is terrible, he probably thinks there's some stuff in that that's amazing too. And so maybe you guys can bounce things back and forth with each other and learn from the process. Um, I'm not opposed to, to employees competing, especially when it comes up to pitches and things like that that your company is doing. Um, I know some people have issues with with employees competing with each other, but I think that it elevates the design, the, the level of design, because you guys are both bouncing things off of each other. You're trying to, to get your design in, and he's trying to get his design in. You guys feel like you guys are somewhat competing, but what turns it negative is when you start feeling like you're a complete failure if he wins or or he starts feeling like he's a complete failure if you win because that's not how that should be. And, and if your employers are making you feel like that, then maybe you should start looking for somewhere else because that's not how that should be. You should be able to compete without the fear of repercussions. And so when you guys are looking at those projects and being able to, 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 to go on parallel paths, 
just just know that you're going to just do the best you can. Do the best work that you can at that time to come up with the best idea that hopefully is a little bit different than your coworkers. And they're going to do the same thing. And then at the end, you guys put all your work together. You look at it and you're like, these frames are awesome. These frames didn't make the par. And so you move on. And you guys praise each other, learn from each other. And that's going to help you guys grow. That's going to help you guys grow as a company. It's going to help you guys grow as creatives together. Um, and I just think that that's better for your mind. So I hope that's a help. Um, let me know some of the ways that you guys handle competing. Um, Cause I know that that's a big thing in our industry um, is, is maintaining that competition, that feeling of competition. So let me know how you guys feel about this. Um, anyway, thank you guys so much for your time. Make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. Um, and I guess I'll see you guys in the next video.